evening and welcome back to KTN Prime. We're glad you're watching. Now, the recent downpour experienced within Nairobi City and in most parts of Kenya could have brought hope for a nation coming out of a biting drought. But you shouldn't be too hopeful just yet. According to the weatherman, the recent showers will only last for the next few days, after which the country could be experiencing some tough times. Recent evening rains experienced in many parts of the country have meant a late start to the rains often expected during the long rain season, which starts in March and ends in May. Tunashukuru mwenyezi mungu. Tunasema ni asante kwa sababu tumekua na ukame. Na hatuo ni ubaya wa mvua. But according to the Meteorological Department Deputy Director Samuel Mwangi, the next few days may not be as wet. This particular wet spell will be short-lived. It's not continuous. We are seeing these rains continuing to about 22nd, 23rd there, and then we go towards uh, drier conditions. And the drier conditions already witnessed in the past have seen Nairobi residents go without water in a rationing exercise resulting from low water levels at the main water reservoir, the Ndakaini Dam. The dam with a capacity of 70 million cubic meters is reportedly storing just slightly above 25% of its full capacity, which is way below the needed threshold to supply water to a city of more than 4 million people. <laughs> The last two weeks, which have seen the city experience limited evening rains, according to the weatherman, may not be enough to end the water crisis just yet. We are receiving a bit of rains now. Capture as much of, of this water as possible. Use it for your domestic use, for your agricultural use. Where there is farming, implement water and the soil moisture conservation measures so that the little rain we are receiving right now can benefit crops to the maximum. Weather patterns from the Metrological Department indicate that the next two weeks may see dry spells witnessed in many parts of the country for a nation already gripped by one of the worst farming situations in recent years. More than 17 counties from the Rift Valley region and western Kenya could experience slight showers